Good morning from sunny Cadin. Today, I'm taking you on an explosive tour inside my Colombian family house, which was built over a hundred years ago and is considered a heritage building here in Cali, Colombia. Let's go. As you can see, this house takes all of the block here and it can accommodate maybe a family of 10. But who's living in this house? Well, my dad, his wife, and my little sister. On this side of the house, we have a gelato shop, which whenever I'm craving ice cream in the afternoon, I just have to come right here and have my ice cream. And this is one of the best I've tried so far in Cali. And before, like uh, maybe two years ago, it used to be a bar. It a beer company, which is also a very famous one in Colombia. My dad went with this terracotta color for the outer part of the house and this blue color for the window frames. Um, I think it is pretty unique and makes it stand out from other houses here in the neighborhood. And actually, like many people come here and take photos right next to the door or right next to this window, which I find it pretty funny. Now, before I show you guys inside, I want to tell you a fun fact about this beautiful house. This house has been a skyscanner face for the city of Cali for I don't know how many years. But actually, if you go into skyscanner and you look at for Cali City, you will sign out this house as the picture of Cali. Isn't that crazy? Now, without further ado, let's go inside. The first thing that will greet you when you come inside our home is this beautiful paint, which was made by my mom. So she used to be a very talented artist. And this is one of my favorite pieces from her. And it's actually mine, so my dad is taking care of this for me. Till the day I'll have a beautiful space where I can put it. <laughs> by the way, this small table was also designed by my mom. Now follow me inside. It's here. Welcome, Dego Saimas. The first thing you can find here is this huge elephant. Okay. This was a piece that was bought by my parents a long, long time ago when I was a kid. And we had it in this uh, house in the, in, up in the mountains where we grew up. And when my dad came here to live in the city, uh, he brought it with him and my mom restored it. And now it's looking like this. Here you will find many pieces from my mom, many tables, many paints from my mom. They're all over the house. This table was also my mom's. And on this wall we have uh, these old pictures from this neighborhood and from Cali in general. So these are pictures uh, from the church here in the neighborhood, which is uphill, up there. Um, this is pictures and this picture over here, come closer. There was nothing before. There used to be only a few houses and it was mostly like mountain. <laughs> Officially welcome. <laughs> <laughs> In these old Colombian houses, it's very common to have this patio. And well, you can see it's full of plants because my dad loves plants. Um, this palm tree used to be like that size when we last came here four and a half years ago it was that size and I was pretty shocked to see it all the way like how much it's, it's grown in this last five years it's crazy by the way yeah that one is to pick up water from the rain and we use it for the plants <laughs> now there's someone I gotta introduce you and this this little frame here. Oh gordito. His name is Jopi, and he is the newest member of the family. He was adopted about a couple of months ago. Yeah, he keeps the house safe. Oh. Bye, Jopi. <laughs> he only likes being pet on the head. <laughs> This corner over here is basically dedicated for both of the cats of this house. Um, I don't know where the other one is, but if we ever meet her, I'll show it to you in a minute. They have their games here, and we have a small couch and small table, and my mom's paints again on the wall. She's actually here. 
doesn't like being pet that much. Ginger? Oui. Ginger? <laughs> Hola, Chiki. On the way to the kitchen, we have this DIY cat house uh, made of cardboard. And <laughs> let's not forget my mom's painting. <laughs> yes, everywhere. And here, well, we have the kitchen. Uh, my dad and his wife renovated it a couple of years ago. And maybe one of the most uh, often asked questions in Colombia is, can I drink cat water? And the answer is, well, it depends. In the house, they have a filter and it comes pretty clean, so it's okay to drink tap water. But we also have uh, the filter from the fridge. Yeah. Yes. And, well, right now you cannot see it, but up there in the mountains, we have from this kitchen, we have a beautiful view of the three crosses that are located on top of that mountain. We gotta go walking up there one day, Kaito. Yes, I understand. Yes. This is one of my favorite drawers here in the kitchen because it's filled with Colombian snacks. But right now, it seems there are more Japanese snacks than Colombian. Osembe, poifu, toka, umaibo, ume. This house has one, two, three, four, five, six, seven rooms. Next to the kitchen, we have this room here, which is my dad's studio. Now my sister is taking up his space. <laughs> Hi. <laughs> and this is the cat's chair where I'm sitting right now. This is where Joppy sits every day. <laughs> and this is where my dad calms the cat. <laughs> <laughs> Brushing. Yes. <laughs> the door here is the bathroom. Um, we have a big shower and a toilet, the sink here. This bathroom was also renovated about maybe a year ago, two years ago, I can't remember. And maybe something that you guys notice is different from Japan. It's how the space is divided. In Colombia, it is very normal to have one room for both the shower and the toilet. But in Japan, as you know, there is one small room for the toilet and a separate room for the shower. And by the way, um, downstairs we have this bathroom and upstairs we have two more bathrooms. <laughs> Before going upstairs, there's also one more room we want to show you guys. <laughs> we have the dining table, which is really large as you can see. So if you guys want to have dinner with us, you're welcome to come. Oh. <laughs> and here's the living room. <laughs> Here, they have, we have a family photo. Probably it's the only family photo we have and this is, was from our wedding oh. four and a half years ago. Is it <laughs> so my dad loves music and he has uh, some, uh, I guess, traditional Colombian instruments here. So whenever he's in the mood, he just <laughs> plays the instruments. <laughs> We're not really good at it, by the way. No, it was good. Now on to the second floor. Let's go. Let's go. So before, uh, over the wall, it was there was a room. Oh yeah. Uh, so that's where I show you guys the gelato shop, mm -hmm. and this was open. You know, there was a bathroom here, actually, and there was another room there. And now they built this wall, and that's where the gelato shop is. Mm. Yeah. Let's go upstairs. If you're up for the challenge, Kaito, because there's quite a few stairs. <laughs> <laughs> we have this area here. Sometimes Kaito and I sit here and we edit our videos here. There's a lot of light coming in. And there's also this other painting which did it when my mom did it. Wow. Beautiful elephant. She was very talented, really. She was very talented. Over here we have what we can call the master bedroom of this house. My dad and his wife's group. I love this space. 
so cool. They also um, changed everything in this room about two years ago because this used to be two separate rooms before. There was a wall here and a small room over there and a different room here. The size of this room before used to be like until here, from here till there. And this part of the room used to be like an um, like a living room, a small living room, but outside of the room. And by the way, guys, if you can see the height of the ceiling, I mean, it's pretty different from Japan. I think this Whoa. is about 3.5 meters tall. Mm -hmm. Yeah, so that's a lot of headroom. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Over here, we have my dad's and pal's bathroom and shower also. Same as downstairs, you have the shower and the toilet in the same space. And they have like a, a furniture here just to keep and organize some of their stuff. The next room is my little sister's room, Gabi. And this is her little paradise, you know. She has like all of her makeup here. I don't know, yeah. She has makeup, little games, her closet over there, toys. And right now, one of her favorite things are these dolls. She has this collection and she's actually saving up to buy these dolls houses. I don't know, I've heard it is super expensive and that's what she really wants right now. So probably one day we'll see it here with a big doll house. <laughs> now let's go to the other side of the house. This room here is actually Kaitis and my bedroom while we're staying here in Colombia. So my dad and his wife Pao organized this space for us. And also we have a guest today, my sister is doing that. So yeah, this is basically our space while we're here. Mada mada arimasu minasan. Follow me. We have another bedroom here. It's also pretty good, pretty big. And this is basically like the guest room, you know? See, there are friends coming, and like Shige, our friend, came from Japan and he stayed in this bedroom. Um, so yeah, basically a small desk, the bed, and my mom's painting once again. Whoa. Moving on to this side of the house. This is a very special room for Gami. Yes. This is her art room. Yes. There's lots of paintings from Gabby, lots of toys. She loves art. And look at this wall. Whoa. Look I at have this. my hand here. This is Gigi's. <laughs> this is my dad's. <laughs> and we're supposed to do it to Kaito and me on the wall here. <laughs> and this is Ginger and Joffrey's spot. <laughs> Their window <laughs> to look at the birds. And here we have the third and last bathroom of this house. Again, same as before, toilet and shower. <laughs> now let me show you the last room in this house and also one of the coolest rooms in the house. So this is Paolo's room. This is my dad's wife's room. She works with leather and she has uh, beautiful things like these small bags, small wallet and this is basically her space her atelier where she brings in clients and she designs the products with them and where she keeps all of her stuff organized by the way guys this is not the house where my sister and i grew up we grew up in a different house located in Dapa, which is a small town in the outskirts of Cali City. And this place was before my dad's company. Um, he had his office here and his employees were here. Everybody was working here. Years later, he decided to finish this business and he started a guest house in this house um, that lasted um, for, I don't know, many years. And right now is just his home where he lives and spends most of the days with his wife and our little sister. Minasan, Ikaga, Deshtakan. Gigi, 
<笑>姉妹揃って日本語を話せます。Yes, very good. <笑>この家、本当にすごいです。もう本当にスカイスキャナーの宣伝になるぐらいの,あの重要な建物でもあります。<笑>僕が最初に来た時はもう本当に感動しました、うん。日本とやっぱり全然違いますよね。高さも、もう天井の高さはまずそもそも違います。もう色の使い方、またその飾り方、いろんなところの,の,その違いっていうのが見て取れたんじゃないでしょうか。それでは、この動画を気に入っていただいた方、ビグナタンさんそしてチャンネル登録をよろしくお願いいたしますそれではまた次回の動画でお会いいたしましょうバイバイバイ This is This is cat Are you right? Yeah I think she doesn't like me that much She doesn't like being pet that much but Anyway Let's keep going guys Wooden windows. <laughs> One day you'll get it right. <laughs>